Today is December 15, 2015. Huh? Yep. Now this Jack Russell, male not neutered, is 10 years old, right? Yep. The main complaint was itchy, right? Yeah, itchy. Which part? Every part? Uh, itchy biting everywhere. Huh? It's biting around the body. Biting the whole body, especially this part. You can see that. Of course, the dog has been picked bought, but you can see this part is, is due to the biting, the bite mark there. And of course, all the paws. Now we're just showing the left side first. The paws biting and the elbow also okay so it's been biting and now we see the belly actually early on it was already all red the whole belly red, but now because of the drug the, the, the redness has gone in fact here it was red also it was red, but now it looks like normal like that okay so the belly the, until the neck was all red reddish okay so this is the left side and the tail also biting tail biting right yeah, so you see on uh, that, you see the right This was the inner sac problem. The inner sac was uh, inflamed and impacted. Okay, now we turn to the left side. Left side. Any scratching of the ears? No. No scratching. Uh. Okay, the left side. Now this was under sedation. This is so quiet. Uh, sedation for clipping board. Now you can see that uh, the nose. How about nose? Nose is okay. Okay. Uh. So overall, the face is okay. And the eyes eh? I need rubbing of the eyes? No. It's okay. Ready. Okay, but you can see that uh, now we see this side, you can see the elbows definitely is self biting uh, and the paws. And uh, this goes for the this side, so right? Mm. It's biting this side. You can see the bite marks or the rashes. This could be bacteria or mites. Dermatetic mites because the rashes are they all they all look alike. But you can see generalized postular dermatitis we call it. And this is the bite marks. Uh, the dog feels very itchy here. And uh, this paw, all the four paws are, are also, also inflamed and itchy. Now, we see below, uh, this part also, his scrotal area also, so, so in, 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 uh, affected. Now, what's the cause? Uh, it's very hard to say, but allergy can be due to food. Shampoo also, because the owner says it's very itchy after shampooing. Uh. So don't use a shampoo already. Uh, sometimes you may have to just use plain water in such cases because shampoos contains a lot of chemicals then uh, the belly was very red just now so it could be contact with the floor there is construction dust which may have settled down on the floor then uh, of course the tail part is the, due to the inner sac inner sac uh, in full uh, the oil cannot come out now as far as the four paws these four paws are concerned normally it's due to an, an allergy of some sort so the dog's paws feels itchy, but how about the ears? Yes, this no. time nothing, the last time? Last time, yes. Uh. Uh, this time the ears are okay. So there's some, some differences. Uh. Uh, now the, I notice the face also is okay. Normally allergy, the face and the eyes will be all very itchy. But then they are not all exactly the same. Uh. But what we can see is there's a lot of rashes. A lot of rashes. These are either bacteria spreading or mites spreading. Uh, you can see. The other part is so itchy the dog bites his backside. He bites right? Yeah. He bites here. Yeah. So now the owner has to to uh, take the anti-allergy drug, uh, anti-allergic uh, diet and then of course antibiotics and, and anti-fungus the medication and a wash and uh, we will review in one month's time hope, hoping that he doesn't, the owner remembers to come back. Sometimes they don't come back until it becomes very bad. December 15, 2015, Jack Russell, male, with a very itchy body, right, and paws, right, but the ears are okay, and the, only the body, the paws, and the backside, itchy.